What's up guys and welcome to another video. So what's up guys and welcome to another video. Thank you for always watching and supporting the channel. Um, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, you already know, <clears throat> give an uppercut to that subscribe button. Um, hit the bell icon so you can stay notified of new videos that I'm gonna be dropping. Um, I've been dropping a, week, a weekly video. I missed a week, but don't worry, because today we are in a Tesla 2021 Model Y. Why? Why I'm in a matter why? Because in the beginning of the month, I took delivery of this vehicle. I've, I've been I've been following up on Tesla for for some time. You know, me and my brother, we we've always been been talking about Tesla, and I've always had my my concerns about it. Um, I'm not saying you know for a couple of months. I'm saying like for the past like two years or so. Just looking and see what progress they're making and all that stuff. Watching a ton of videos, see people's experiences and stuff like that, and um. And I said, wow, you know, I know gas prices were going up as well. My lease from my Nissan Rogue was up and it was time to, you know, get a new car. We live in the state of Connecticut and two cars is most ideal. You know, we got my wife uses the, the Rogue. I use another car. So I was just like, you know, trying to figure out like what we were going to do since our lease was up. So I um, was comparing like space, size, comfort. Um, and tech, right? So I thought, man, hey, listen, let's see what, what else, you know, Tesla is doing. So they dropped this Model Y and they did a first generation of it. So I waited because usually you'd get into a Tesla and when they launch, you know, the, the first, you know, iteration of, of the vehicles, sometimes there, there's a lot of, you know, hurdles that people go through. So I was just seeing, you know, what a lot of people were going through. Um, <clears throat> and then you know just making my decision from there so thank god tesla dropped a second generation um model y that did a lot of major improvements and stuff so when i did delivery and picked it up you know a lot of the things that uh, other people were doing as far as checking like the door jams and making sure all the lines were even on the vehicle and all that other stuff if 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 you watch and you follow you know a lot of other tesla videos you'll see a lot of people talking about you know all the little discrepancies that they've had um when they make their orders but i'm glad i thank god that i was able to get the vehicle um and check everything out and so far so good um i love it my wife loves it and and we've been having a a, a really cool time with it we actually did our first road trip the road trip was was a breeze it wasn't that bad um made about like six seven stops um probably if i was if i was spending money on electricity for the superchargers i probably would have spent about 40 bucks but because i had a referral link from a good friend of mine uh, uh josh who um sent me his referral link i was able to get the um uh, the tesla wood and also receive a thousand miles of free supercharging so that helped me out on the long trip that that we were doing to florida and it was it was so cool um just going in parking you know waiting the you know 15 minutes whatever charging it up taking my little dog out to to eat and do his things um and it was it was a breeze so it was so good so you know the the space was it was so comfortable you know what i mean and, and there's so many other features that the that the vehicle has but just to go over just a few of them right they, it has 12 uh two 12 volt uh ports which is back here um the little compartment in the back where i was at it has one in the glove compartment there it has wireless charging pads for two phones um the whole front council has been updated if you um you, you can you can see the difference between if you look online you know between the first generation of the of the model y the um um the whole center council has been changed and revamped um the the um the screen is like it's a 15 or 17 inch screen um <clears throat> the seats i went with the white seats uh with the black seats instead the the black vegan seats 
easy to clean. Uh, while I was at the uh, um, the delivery pickup location, the guys out there told me, listen, you could clean this whole entire car with Purell hand sanitizer. Amazing, simple. Just put it on a, <clears throat> on a microfiber and you'll be good to go. You could just clean the whole entire car with Purell hand sanitizer, plus sanitize your vehicle at the same time. We already know COVID with all this stuff that's going on. But anyways, um, this, the, the back seats are retractable. Got the two buttons right there on the side. I'm not gonna go too much in depth for all the, the features. Um, I just wanted to do an overall just view of the car, my perspective on it, why we went with the vehicle. Um, maybe I'll do you know uh, another video with all the features that the car has. Um, I know there's a ton of video of, of Teslas and all their, all their tech that they have. Maybe I might do one as well and just give my perspective, what things I do like and what things I don't like, but that I was already aware of it getting into it because you know Teslas operate off of firmware updates. If you don't know what firmware updates are, they're just over the air updates that, that the computer receives from Tesla whenever they're gonna you know, modify or make some improvements to the vehicle. The good thing about the car is that when you have it parked, right in your garage you just plug it in and if they decide to do an update to the to the infotainment system they want to give you more miles they want to update a specific feature since everything is done <clears throat> through the through the computer screen itself you can see that, that there's not a lot of if you look up in the front that there, there's not a lot of you know buttons everything is on the screen um so if you're not a techie person it may be a little bit tricky but it's not hard it's very easy to get used to um so with that being said like all the all the updates are receiving over the air they're receiving it wirelessly you connect your car to your normal wi-fi at home and then from there all the updates are just going to come down as you um as you just charge in and plug in the vehicle, you know, on a weekly or monthly basis, when whenever Tesla sends out a new update, you'll receive it, you'll update it, and you could be sleeping and your, your car is getting updated with some with some new features, maybe extending the amount of miles you get on the vehicle. Um, the last vehicle we had had about like uh, 287 or about, yeah, 287 miles uh, for the gallon. I'm getting about 335 around there with one charge, 335 miles per charge. So to just give you some perspective, I'm in Connecticut. I drove from Connecticut and my first stop was in Maryland. Um, so that was a pretty cool experience going from Connecticut all the way to Maryland on a first uh, on one charge, charged it for about like 10 15 minutes and we kept going on from there everything else was like almost like state to state as as i charged the vehicle um it's the the car is pretty dope my my experience with it, with it so far has been so cool i do love the the space the back seats are so spacious um i did a few little modifications here and there because the, the modifications that you can do on this vehicle are so like they're, they're so minute, but they make a big difference in, in the way the car looks. It's not that expensive either, the little modifications that you can do, but it's it's like super spacious. I can't wait to do like a another road trip and you can actually fit a mattress back here. They make these specific beds that you can just lay back here. The, the, the screen is equipped with Netflix, with Hulu, with YouTube, YouTube TV, and there's a couple of other sites where you can actually log in and, and into web-based uh, uh, portals on the on the internet that it has and you can actually access you know other applications um, while you charge or if you want to stay overnight whatever I got a huge panoramic uh, sunroof right here I have it covered right now with a with a sunroof cover because it could it get it can get really really hot in here because the whole top is glass but this is the Tesla Model Y 2021, man. And I wanted to just give you my experience. I got some clips that I'll probably show you right now with the delivery and and um, um, how excited I was. And just it's not much, but you can take a look into that right now. So I'm here, Tesla, uh, at the just the parking station waiting so I can finalize everything else. So far, the experience has been has been cool. It's been good. 
um, no hassle. Everything is done through the application. Um, it's been it's been great. Like a lot of people were talking about like certain imperfections on the car, like the right here, the the, the trimmings and all that stuff. But actually, I can say that compared to all the other videos that I've seen, it's actually really, really, really been good. Like they've they've really improved the um, the whole construction of it. You know, the rockers, the um, the hood or the frunk. Um, the, the, the trunk so everything is pretty much looking good I'm about to see Dylan right now from and get everything finalized so keep watching all right so we're all done here I got my my key which is my phone obviously I'm using it but um, I spoke to Dylan something actually pretty cool that he told me about it was that inside since the seats and everything is vegan leather you could actually clean this whole and even all this right all this the seats everything you could clean it just with purell and a and a wipe that's it a wipey a nice microfiber cloth and purell cleans the whole entire uh, cleans the whole entire car and now even better because it even sanitizes it um when you're cleaning it it's purell it's sanitizer so it's freaking amazing man so my first experience with the car the delivery everything was all good um keep watching because i'm gonna throw up another video of just like to talk about the experience of the car and, and whatnot and you know what was the actual detailed process with getting you know the car it's a little sometimes it could be a little bit misleading the information and it's not a regular dealership that's the problem right it's not a regular dealership so everything is done through the Tesla website, you don't really speak to a lot of people that much, you know what I'm saying? Unless you speak to customer service when you got other like questions. But um, the process is all done through the phone and literally like you just come here to pick it up and it's, it's all good, all good to go. So uh, thank you for watching. This is my delivery model Y and stay tuned for some more video clips that I'm gonna be doing of just explaining the full detail like the whole process all right Ooh. oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah uh-huh yep 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 Look at that. all right guys later so you see i got i got to the um uh, tesla location Everything was was done through the um, through the app, the delivery, the pickup. When when you get to the location, you don't you you, you scan your barcode. You see somebody there, probably telling you, you know what I mean, if you need help finding your car, because there's a, a lot, and you just basically go to each car and check the VIN number and see if it matches the one that um, they assigned to you. But it's it's all good, man. I'm loving it so far it's been it's been great it's super fast but yet it's like so simple right it's so simple in every single way but it has so much cool tech and and it's just great so i just wanted to to share my little experience with the car so far i've had it for about a month i haven't even got my license plates yet so i'm still on temporary plates um but i should be getting in the next couple of days which is good and this is the tesla model y uh my new video this is it i'm inside the the vehicle right now you see here um i was inside the compartment right when i did the intro that goes give you some perspective of how big the underneath compartment is on top of this main space that you have here to just put whatever whatever you want um and there it is the tesla model y be creative be great experience with it and stay tuned for some more videos that i'm going to be doing maybe talking about the technology in here every single piece of of tech that this has uh compartments um the the infotainment uh system how it works what things it has if you're looking um into getting one i'll have my referral link in the description of this video um if you do purchase one or, or pre-order one once you fully get the delivery of the car, you will get a thousand miles of free supercharging. Same thing for me. Um, 
so we help each other in that in that sense but this is my other video i wanted to to drop another video and and um, um and just you know i wanted to do it a little bit sooner but i said you know what let's let's wait a while you know let's drive the car and what what not better way to test it by just doing a, a long road trip the road trip was plus a1 um but thank you again for watching the video um if you haven't yet subscribed make sure you subscribe to the video mm, remember uppercut that subscribe button hit that bell icon so you can be notified of new videos that i'm going to be dropping on a weekly basis so stay tuned and never settle with being good when you have been meant to be great later Thank you.